There are mysteries all around us, and we are fascinated by what we cannot understand. Inexplicable phenomena are discovered every day, keeping our curiosity piqued and the prospect of knowing the world around us a foreign concept. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we'll be looking at three recent discoveries exploring the deep dark corners of the universe, its unexplained phenomena and the mysteries that surround us. V830 Tauri Radio Emissions Something that is 2 million years old might seem ancient to us. In space, being 2 million years old makes us start extremely young. At exactly this age, T Tauri V830 Tau is a star with a similar mass to Jupiter and a fairly circular 4.93 day orbit according to recent observations. The reason this star fascinates astronomers, though, is its seemingly sporadic and intermittent radio emissions, detected at 6 and 8.4 GHz. It is not strange for magnetized exoplanets to emit at various radio frequencies, as seen with V830 Tau. However, in this case, it is the first detected radio emissions from a planetary system outside of our own solar system which occurs around a star. Therefore, it has become a star of focus for many scientists, keen to better understand the interactions between this star and its planets. Modeling variables such as wind formation around the newborn host star, scientists at the likes of Harvard are conducting studies to simulate local conditions and the environment around V830 Tau. Their findings to date are quite complex and technical. Revolving around data pertaining to stellar radii, maximum frequency emissions, and polar planetary magnetic fields, there are more simple things they have discovered too. Firstly, for these radio emissions to have been detected here on Earth, which means passing through host star winds, the magnetic field of V830 Tau and any nearby planets must be between 1.3 and 13 G. Similarly, they have been able to estimate thermal conditions based on wind factors, planetary radius, as well as likely orbital distance, thought to be 6.1 stellar radar, for those of you who are curious. Other reports cite the importance of such discoveries, being those giant planets with a tight parent planet orbit have recently been found to orbit younger, hotter stars instead. Being young, this would include the likes of V830 Tau. With so much more to learn and understand about this star, many are excited at the potential to find out more about planetary formations and migrations of new solar systems. An asteroid barely missed Earth in November. Asteroid 2021 UA1 Asteroids are fascinating and many are absolutely zero cause for concern in terms of hitting or harming the Earth but every once in a while there will be one or two which come in just a bit too close for NASA's liking. Small asteroids a few meters in size pass between the Earth and our Moon's orbit several times a month. Meteoroids, asteroids less than one meter in diameter, hit the Earth's atmosphere and explore pretty much every day. With tens of thousands of small rocks passing through the atmosphere daily, mainly from Saturn's belt, this is no surprise to us, and none of these pose any threat to our safety here at home. Just a few months ago in November, an asteroid passed by Antarctica missing the surface by a mere 1,800 miles, and scientists did not know about it until after the fact. But do not panic. Although it came scarily close, and closer than any have in quite some time, for asteroids to be classed a threat, they have to measure more than 460 feet in diameter, and this one, UA1, was just 6.6 .6 feet. It would usually have been detected sooner than it was. Astronomers explained that it approached the Earth from its daytime side, in other words, from the direction of the Sun, meaning it essentially came hurtling from a blind spot in our observation capabilities. Furthermore, being so small, it would have been hard to detect and track. In fact, many small asteroids pass near to Earth without us realizing, scientists say. Regardless, as said, owing to its small size, it never would have been a proper threat anyway. For context though, 1800 miles is closer than most asteroids make it. 
A month after UA1, asteroid WK1, measuring 64 feet long, passed the Earth at 625,000 miles, and this was one of the closest anticipated encounters for 2021. Similarly, the next four asteroids expected to come close to Earth, according to NASA's Asteroid Watch dashboard, will not come within 3 million miles of Earth. While it is shocking to think that an asteroid came so close to Earth without our prior knowledge, it's still reassuring to know that it was too small to have done any damage. And the next asteroid expected to actually collide with the Earth is thought to be some 300 years away, meaning we are all safe for now. Astronomers find mysterious cavity in space 500 light years away. Although 500 light years away, this last discovery is actually from within our own Milky Way. Astronomers have recently discovered an enormous cavity which they believe was the result of a stellar explosion millions of years ago. Described as a bubble shaped void, they discovered the cavity between the Perseus and Taurus constellations. More precisely, it was found in a star-forming region, which is a cluster of gas and dust which to date scientists believe form from supernovas. Having mapped the Perseus-Taurus constellation star-forming region, data collected by the Gaia spacecraft revealed the huge cavity which previously went unnoticed by 2D mapping systems. Scientists had long been aware of this star region. The depth and thickness of the molecular clouds associated with the region had been a mystery for some time. There are a couple of current theories as to the presence of the void within this star-forming region. Either it is possible that a supernova exploded at the core of the bubble, pushing gas outwards and expanding the cavity, or a series of supernovae over the period of millions of years created and added to it over time. Although they may not know for sure what caused this phenomenon, scientists are well aware of how much more there is to learn about the region and supernova-related events in general. Discovering this void while trying to understand how gas and dust are released and rearranged during stellar explosions, they now want to turn their focus to the chain of events triggered by the ending of a star and the resulting supernova explosion. But what do you make of these outer space discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.